Grand rising, my friends. I am Abraham Lincoln, the 16th Commander-in-Chief of the United States and Defender of the American Union. As we stand on the precipice of the future, I wish to share with you a truth that has guided me through the tryings and miseries of my own life. It is encapsulated in a simple yet thoughtful saying. A river cuts through rock, not because of its power, but because of its persistence. Consider the river, my friend. It begins as a humble trickle, a mere droplet of water. It does not possess the immediate force of a hammer striking stone, nor the swift devastation of a lightning bolt. Yet over time, this gentle stream can carve a path through the hardest of rocks. This is not a testament to the river's strength, but rather its persistence. Day after day, year after year, the river flows. It does not cease when it meets resistance. It does not falter when it encounters a boulder in its path. Instead, it continues, unwavering, until the rock yields to its gentle but constant pressure. In our own lives, we often find ourselves faced with obstacles as formidable as a mountain. We may not have the strength to move them, nor the power to shatter them. But like the river, we have within us the capacity for unyielding effort. We can choose to rise each day, to face our challenges, to continue our journey, no matter how difficult it may seem. We can choose to be patient, to persevere, even when progress seems slow or non-existent. For it is not the strength of our blows, but the insistence of our efforts, that will ultimately lead to success. So, my fellow patriots, when you find yourself faced with a rock in your path, remember the river. Do not despair if you lack the power to remove it. Instead, be enduring. Continue to strive, to learn, to grow. And in time, you too will see that the greatest obstacles can be overcome, not through power, but through persistence. Remember, the river's journey is long and its path is not straight, but it never ceases in its pursuit of the sea. Be like the river, be persistent, and you too will carve your own path through the rocks of life. I love you, you love you, God loves us, and that's all that matters.